Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, uh, chummy. Welcome to the Daily Grind. How you doing out there this morning? Good, I hope. I hope you're having a great morning. Hope you have a great day today, by golly, all day long. Let's get crack lagging. Life. Life, man, it's a crazy ride. Crazy, crazy ride. Listen, I'm going to tell you something about life. Uh, it ain't fair. Never was, never will be. It's just life. You are granted life, and that's it. You get, you can make what you can make out of it. Yeah, some people are born into it. You know, they're born into all kinds of money, and they got this great life. And other people are born so poor they, it's just not even funny. That's life. There's nothing you can do about that. You got a shot at it. So here's what I learned early on in school. When I was a young kid in school, you know, I realized right away that life wasn't the same. You know, you get all the the rich kids in there, they get all the designer clothes and nice cars and they get everything. And then you got other kids that, like myself, I didn't have anything. I mean, we just didn't have anything. Uh, I just had to wear the cheap clothes and, you know, it's kind of tough. You get made fun of and you feel like you're less than. I learned real early on back then that you ain't going to get anywhere by complaining. You're not going to get anything. It's not going to change things. All it's going to do is make you more miserable. You can be a victim or you can be a victor. What did I do? I got busy and went to work. I didn't have much choice. I had to work because my dad was sick and uh, I had to work. But I learned, you know, that I can make my own way in life. Uh, I, I can live by chance or I can live by choice. And if I live by chance, I'm just going to get what I get. If I live by choice, uh, then I might have something to say in how my life goes. And I've worked hard at it to uh, to get where I want. And I don't compare myself to others because I'm going to tell you something right now. Anytime you compare your insides to somebody else's outside, you're going to feel like crap. It's just not going to work. So what did I do? I just got busy taking care of my own life. I learned a lot of things along the way. I remember talking to one guy, and talking about competition in the business world. And he says, I don't have any competition. I said, what do you mean you don't have any competition? I don't pay no attention to them. He said, I just worry about myself. Once again, changed my thinking. It's like, hmm... From that time on, I didn't worry about what anybody else was doing. I just worried about what I was doing. People would say, well, this guy said that, that guy said that, so I don't really care what they said. This is what I can do for you, and I just paid attention to me, and I just kept focusing on what I could do for myself and what I could do to help out my customers and made my life go in the right direction. I lived by choice. I chose to focus on doing what I could do to make my life a better life, and I became a victor instead of a victim. Like I said, I learned a long time ago, complaining and pissing and moaning isn't going to change things. Life is still going to be what it is. It's, it's not going to make it fair because you sit around and complain about it. Get up off your duff and do something. It says in the big book, in the good book, uh, that you have to make your way in this world. God will help you out, but it, it says, his word says, you have to make your way in this world. So, you can sit around and pray until you're blue in the face, but if you don't get up off your duff and do something, ain't nothing going to happen. If you pray, you ought to be willing to do your part. If you ask God to move a mountain, bring a damn shovel, because you got some digging to do. And once you get to digging and start doing your part, then you'll see some help show up. But you have got to make your way in this world. So instead of complaining about life not being fair, get up off your death and do something that, so you can make your own life better. Stop comparing yourself to others. You're in size to others' outsides. Don't worry about what anybody else is doing. You're not living their life. What do you, you don't even know what's going on. They might have all kinds of stuff. When Howard Hughes died, he was one of the richest men in the world, and he died of malnutrition. He starved to death. So what good did all his money do him? He wasn't right. Something wasn't right if he starved to death with all that money. So you see, you don't know what's going on in somebody else's mind. They might look like they have it all together, but they might be in way worse shape than you are. So don't worry about whether life is fair. Just get up off your duff and do what you can to make your life better. Don't bitch and complain, piss and moan. Move. Pray and move. Pray and pray like everything depends on God and act like everything depends on you and things are going to happen and you're going to be in much better shape. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. I hope you have a great day today, man. Over.